The general public is hereby informed that uh, the joint investigative team from the Anti-Corruption Commission, Zambia Police Service, Drug Enforcement Commission, and Financial Intelligence Center has since concluded investigations involving Margaret Chisela Musonda, alias Faith Musonda, in which she was found to be in possession of 65 million 333,046 kwacha and 57,900 US dollars, which was discovered in a house in New Kasama. The general public is further informed that on Friday, 15th October 2021, the state, using Section 80 of the Anti Corruption Act Number no. 3 of 2012, entered into an undertaking not to institute criminal proceedings against uh, Ms. Musonda on condition that she fulfills the requirements of Section 80 of the Anti-Corruption Act Number no. 3 of 2012, which she did. Section 80 of the Act allows the state to grant amnesty to accused persons in certain instances on condition that they admit wrongdoing and return what they wrongfully acquired through corrupt practices. The advantage of using Section 80 in cases of asset recovery is that it saves on time by eliminating the prosecution process, which can be lengthy, uh, leading to assets losing value or getting damaged. And it also saves on the cost of investigation and prosecution. So according to, actions, uh, according to Section 80, Subsection 3 of the Anti-Corruption Act Number no. 3 of 2012, the Anti-Corruption Commission may tender an undertaking in writing not to institute criminal proceedings against a person who A, has given a full and true disclosure of all material facts relating to past corrupt conduct and an illegal activity by that person or others. B, has voluntarily paid, deposited, or refunded all property the person acquired through corruption or illegal activity. As required by law, Ms. Musonda has since made a full disclosure of the monies in question and has willingly surrendered the same to the state. She was charged with uh, possession of property reasonably suspected to be proceeds of crime, contrary to Section 71 of the Forfeiture of Proceeds of Crimes Act Number no. 19 of 2010.